Hello guys, this is Shetan Verma. So till here we have completed some of the data types. Now talking about another data type called sequence. Sequence in Python. So there are different data types under this. So first is str, which is also called a string. So let's talk about a string. In Python, str represents a string, uh, a string data type. Uh, a string is represented by a group of characters. The strings are enclosed in the single quote or double quote. Both are valid. In Python, both are valid. Suppose you have a string, suppose uh, a equal to hello and b equal to shetan or single in a uh, single quote will be accepted. It is also valid in Python. Okay, we can also write strings inside uh, triple uh, double quotes or triple single quotes to span a group of line inside spaces. We have talked regarding this so far. So like this we can do a equal to hello uh, this is Chetan Varma for multiple line of code we can do Chetan Varma hi so for this triple single quote or triple double quote will be accepted so let's do some programming on it so we'll understand more about it so control plus a then a equal to hello H -E, hello or b equal to uh, single quote here i have sent sing inside the single quote and for triple quote let's see for triple quote uh hello this is chetan varma hi how are you how are you so let's print it all print all of this print a then print b then print c also prints its data type so print uh, type type of a and control plus c type of b b and here we will also put type of c control plus s and open one more window for this so data type dot by here you can see for a equal to we assigned a equal to hello so hello is printed here in b we assign chetan chetan is printed here in c we have assigned multiple line string value so it is also accepted and uh, printed here and all these things the type of all these variables are only string so i hope you have understood the concept of string one more thing the slice operator uh, represents here we have slice operator inside the string so let's look some uh, look something about uh, slice operator what is it so slice operator represents square bracket we have square bracket okay to retrieve pieces of a string for example suppose you have a equal to welcome welcome to python or core python core python okay and you want to make it slice the character in a string are counted from zero onwards this is zero character first second third fourth fifth sixth space is also in character here then eighth ninth then tenth eleventh twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteenth seventeenth up to so hence is uh, suppose a zero means w let's look into it let's do some programming so we'll understand more about it 
a equal to welcome to core python okay and print only a square bracket zero so it should print only uh, starting starting character w so we can see w has been printed here so if i just want to print all this uh, string so it will print entire print a will uh, print entire string welcome to core python but print uh, print uh, print a will print a square bracket zero will print uh, w print uh, a square bracket zero to suppose i want to print welcome so zero one two three four five six so zero to six will print welcome only okay and uh, i just want to print come then for come print a square bracket 3 to 3 to 7 let's check it out whether it works or not 3 to 7 control plus s and let's check it out for uh, w like we have print uh, a uh, so it printed entire string welcome to core python we have print a square bracket zero so it has been printed w only from zero to seven we wanted to print welcome okay actually it included first uh, uh, numeric but it not uh, it, for including uh, this we need to increase one more value so now it will include 0 to 6 entire welcome so here you can see 0 to 7 it will not include last value okay and from 3 to uh, 3 to uh, see uh, 3 to 7 3 to 7 come so 3 to 7 okay one more trick is here if we want to reverse our string so what we do we just want first of first of thing if we want to print this last letter and we don't know uh, the length of the string so for that you no need to do anything you just do this thing only minus one so it will print n the last character of the string is n and it has printed here you can see this is printed here okay and if you want to reverse it so this is also simple from here you leave so it will print the reverse part control plus s and a reverse of the string will be uh, sorry to uh, suppose i want to print up to minus 7 minus 7 okay i didn't close this control plus s new screen okay oh some mistake is okay 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 this is not true in uh, uh, true in uh, string but it is true in uh, this concept is true in uh, this particular list sorry so now it will show the end letter okay the repetition operator is denoted uh, here as an star symbol we have repetition if we want to repeat our string twicely if you want to repeat our uh, string twicely, suppose we, we have a equals to Chetan and we want to print Chetan twice. So what we do? So we don't need to do anything. We just print A and star 2. So it will print this Chetan twicely. Okay. So let's see how it will do. Sorry.
suppose I want to print this uh, swing twicely so I no need to do anything this is start to and it will print welcome to core python welcome to core python that's it okay and if one if i want to print it uh, four times same nothing else welcome to python welcome to python welcome to python welcome to python same okay so this is all about string uh, now let's talk about the another data type we have pipe data type that we will cover in our next video so thank you for today have a good day